Yep, that's right. For Father's Day, Daddy wanted Indian food. We found a new place we love. We're going to show it to you. Oh, man, it's going to be so good. Very, very good. Mm, there we go. There we go. I'm going to sit over here. Whoever wants to sit by me. Oh, sit. I want to sit by you. They had the, we've eaten almost all of them, but they're these little, uh, <laughs> what are you doing? They're these little uh, chippy sort of, I don't know, noodly things. Katie has hers, and we're eating it with this mint sauce. It's delicious. Timmy has a joke. Who's there? Hello. I love when you change formats mid joke. Why did the why did the cow cross the road? To get to the other side. Now, if you could just say that and not be like, you know, Chucky while you're saying it, that'd be great. We got our peppers and our, our onions and delicious rice. Look at that pile. Look at that pile of deliciousness. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Katie. You're gonna get some yellow rice too. They're making you biryani. Like a veggie biryani, simple biryani. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mommy's favorite is korma, right? Yeah, it's very, very good. And it's kind of sweet. It's by far the best Indian place we have. Period. By, by far the Period. best Indian restaurant. I haven't found anything better. No. And the depth of flavor is crazy. This, this rivals anything that we got we had in India. Oh yeah, oh yeah. For sure. Yeah, absolutely. They made Katie like this. Uh, I forget the name of it, but her her little like well, yellow rice. right, right. It's a yellow rice, but it has like I don't I don't know. If, uh, yeah, I think it's kind of like biryani. It is. It tastes a little different, but it has um, some kind of nut in it. I don't know if it's fennel. But it's really tasty. Everything here is layered with taste. Mm -hmm. Nothing is simple. Right. Nothing is Americanized. And it's so delicious. So, so good. You happy, Katie? <laughs> How was it, Logie? Delicious, huh? Oh my goodness. He went through so much rice. He liked the yellow rice, too. He keeps putting it on his naan and eating it that way. That's delicious. Katie's got a completely cleared plate. Want to take the rice home? Mm -hmm. Timmy ate almost all his chicken, and now he's just working on a plate full of rice. And all this man has left is a lowly little half pile of rice. Was it good? Was it good? It's like so good. I don't know if there's a word to describe how good it is. It's the best Indian food I've ever had. Yes. So, so delicious. Could you imagine like if this was just normal and you get to eat this way every day? Like, oh. We wouldn't appreciate it. Oh. We wouldn't appreciate it. Ah, uh, that's true. Anything you get to have every day, you don't appreciate it. Not like how sick you are of spaghetti. <laughs> that's true. Before vacation, we ate spaghetti often. What did you wipe on mom? Ew, don't do that. You better hide. So I don't know if I've mentioned it in the video so far, but we actually got the kids butter chicken and Melanie and I got chicken tikka masala and they're really similar except one has more layered flavors and the other is very basic. Uh, and I tried both for the first time side by side. I've never had them at the same meal side by side. I gotta dip some naan in one and dip some naan in the other and try them like back to back. And uh, I definitely like tikka masala more. It's just more more flavor. There was multiple types of peppers and onion in it and that was really, really tasty. So that's my favorite thing I probably had today. In fact, why don't we do a rating? How about we rate? Remember how we rated stuff in our last Indian video? Let's do that. We're gonna go around and rate the korma chicken and the butter chicken. And mommy, you rate the tikka masala. Okay, Caleb, what do you rate the korma and what do you rate the butter chicken? The korma, five. It's like, so good. Okay, and the butter chicken? Um, four. Four, okay. Yeah. Timbalicious, what do you rate the korma chicken, the yellow one? A five ten. Okay, so a five. What do you rate the butter chicken? Mm -hmm. One hundred. One hundred, so not quite as high as the korma, I guess. Okay, Katie, what do you rate the korma chicken? chicken. <laughs> Okay, and what about the butter chicken? And the other one? Um, a five? Okay. Okay, Logie Bear, what do you rate the korma chicken? I rate the korma chicken a four because of the 
stuff on top of it. It didn't sound that good. Okay, and what about the butter chicken, the red one? I like the five. A five? Ooh. Last but not least, Mama, what do you rate the korma? <laughs> a five. Easily a five, right? Okay, and what do you rate the tikka masala? Four and a half. Four and a half? Oh, wow, that's higher than I expected. Like you even, because you're not big on onions and peppers, right? Like even if you order a fajita, you're not you're not going deep into the onions and peppers, like right? No, no, I didn't Right, right, but still, like the sauce and the general taste. Four and a half. Do you have it to change your score? Um, I rate it. Um, Stop it. <laughs> so everyone else is having ice cream. Katie didn't want any. You know Zuka, which is not big on ice cream. But mommy's mommy's intuition said, I think we should get a rice pudding. And I was like, no way, she's not gonna like it. Do you like it? And you said it reminds you of something? Yeah, it reminds me of that. It wasn't that one that where like, you guys picked me up. So now it was now with the hunt. Yeah, that one and that one. When on, when we took a nap, then we woke up. Yeah. We had snack time. We have snack time. Sometimes we have like for snack some lunch. Okay, yeah. Basically, and they, and they, would they give you rice pudding? Well, yeah, sometimes they gave us that. Or what about yogurt? Ever like anything with yogurt in it? Uh -uh. Okay. It tastes just like this. Really? Yeah. That's in. Uh, well, I bet they gave you something like rice pudding. That's amazing. I say thanks to mom because mom totally, <laughs> mom totally uh, used her mom's intuition to bless Katie with something we didn't expect. Pretty cool. It was incredible! Everyone nice and full? Yeah. We're gonna go home now because we gotta get the home ready for my sister and brother-in-law who are visiting us this week. A lot of fun vlogs with Aunt Barbie and Uncle John. You guys ready to have them over? Yeah! I know, it's gonna be so fun. We love you, Zoo family. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, and share. We'll see you next time! Bye.